Okay, so I'm going to be doing some hunting on the the new map here on the Hunter. Um, I'm going to proceed up the climbing rope here. I had a lot of trouble climbing at first. I don't know why, but uh, this climbing gear is set up right behind the uh, the lodge down here in the corner. So it's pretty convenient, real close. And I usually see a lot of Ibex up here, so... I might even hunt some bear, some bear here later on. So we'll see. The other day it took me like ten tries to get up this, but I think I'm getting a little better at it. So we'll see. You just gotta use your left and right arrows to keep balance, and sometimes it'll go really fast, and you gotta like hold it, like kind of how it is now. Sometimes I get up easier than others. I don't know why. Uh, it's going pretty fast. Uh, oh, God. It's always a relief when you just get up there and you don't have to worry about falling. Alright, and we're up. Oh, no. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell? What is going on? Wow, okay, I about fell. I thought I was up there and then it come back. But anyways, we're up and this is beautiful. So uh, let's see if we can't get us some Ibex. Okay, so I've been, <coughs> I've been crouching and uh, I hear an Ibex extremely close. and I, So I stopped here. It's It's got to be on the other side of this big rock here. I wish I would have brought my... Oh, there it went. I didn't even get an eye on it. Very, very freakish, skittish animals. And there it is. <sighs> ah, beautiful shot there. Perfect shot, executed beautifully. And yeah, as you can see, that's an example of how skittish these animals can be. Uh, that's why a lot of times I'll crouch and I'll just pick up a track and take it where it leads me. And uh, the Ibex had have been right here on the other side of this rock, but uh, we'll go down there and bag this thing and see what uh, see what we got. Okay, so uh, we're just getting up here to the Ibex, and uh, it's starting to rain on us here. I really don't know if this is a male or a female, to be honest. I didn't get a spot on it, but it don't look too bad. Okay, so 172, a male. Okay. Um, Looks like I hit it from 105 meters away, made a perfect shot on it, and uh, that's our first Ibex of the day, so let's go out and try to get us get us some more Ibex here. Alright, so uh, I'm not really too far away from when I shot that other Ibex, but I was scoping up on the mountain, and I happened to see this Ibex sitting up there. Um, I think I'm going to take the shot, so we'll see how this goes. Alright, it's down. And it's sliding on down the mountain. Alright, so I'm gonna set a marker down so I can go to the marker and uh, we'll see what we got. Alright, and as I pop up over this little mountain, I can see the Ibex line here. And uh, again, I don't know if it's male or female. I didn't get a spot. Uh, it was kind of out of my distance to get a spot. Looks like a male. Might even be bigger than the last one. Uh, let's see, my last one was a 172. Was, eh, I don't think it's as big, but we'll see. 169, so about the same size. Now, again, made a good shot. Left lung, right lung, so perfect. And uh, that's Ibex number two, so... Uh, <coughs> We'll see if we can't get some more. All right, and uh, I was just actually again, I'm I'm really not too far from the last ibex I shot, and uh, I just happened to pull out my uh, binoculars here, and I can see an ibex. He's real far up there. I'd say he's 207 meters, 
Uh, I really wish I was using my 50 times zoom scope, but I'm not. Um, so I'm gonna lay down here and uh, <clears throat> we're gonna take a shot here again. He's about 200 meters away, very very far shot. So let's see how it goes. Oh yeah, dropped him. Beautiful. That was uh, my furthest shot I've ever taken on an Ibex. So we'll mark it with the binoculars again, and we will see you when we get up there. Okay, so uh, we are finally getting to our Ibex here. Uh, looks like he got stopped on that rock. Looks like it's another male. I'm seeing a lot of males today, which is good. Not as big as the others, I don't think. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I hit him. Uh, Oh, that's a he that's actually a female. Uh, 206 meters away. I hit her right in the neck bone. As you can see, it's red on the neck bone. So uh, I made a you know a good shot, a good clean shot. So uh, we'll see if we can't get yet any more ibex. I'm looking. I'm still looking for that big monster. So we'll see if we can't get one. All right, guys. Unfortunately, I couldn't find any more ibex. So I decided to uh, fast travel. Uh, I'll show you. I I fast travel to this lodge right here. Um, and uh, I love going down this river. This river, uh, I, it's always active. You, you usually will see a lot of bears. So I'm going to travel down this river on foot. And uh, we're going to see if I can't find a bear and uh, bag a bear to end the video. So, uh, yeah, we'll see, what, we'll see what we can't find down here. Okay, so I spotted a bear uh, across the river here. I'm going to lay down and try to get a spot on him. Looks like a pretty big bear too. Let's hope it's a male. There he is. And uh yep, it's a male, so I'm definitely gonna take him. He looks pretty big. Perfect, I got good prone shot. Aim right for the heart here. Again, beautiful shot. This gun here is amazing. So let's walk up there and uh, get that big boy. Alright, so we're just getting to the bear, and uh, I'm kind of anxious to see what he scores. I, I don't think it's any kind of record. The uh, the record brown bear is 28. Uh, but he's, he, I'm, I'm guessing he's in the 20s, but I could be wrong. We'll see what he scores here. 24. Okay, that's probably my biggest brown bear. Um, hit him right in the neck bone, so instantly dropped him, and I'll definitely get a trophy picture of this. But uh, I want to say thanks for watching, guys, and uh, definitely sub to my channel. I'm uh, I'm always gonna be uh, uploading videos, um, just different game, different you know scenarios. I do bow hunting, uh, rifle hunting, just pretty much whatever I, I feel like doing. Uh, but yeah, definitely sub to my channel. Um, and uh, if there's anything you want, you want to see me hunt, or what gun to use, you know, whatever, just comment, let me know. But I'll set this trophy pick up. And uh, so yeah, thanks for watching. Definitely sub, like, do whatever. Thanks.